Hey guys, we've got another um, customer spotlight here. Um, today I am uh, I'm excited to share uh, Umbrella Drywall's story and I have Nick from Umbrella Drywall here today. And we're gonna go through just a quick couple of questions for Nick and, and get um, a good idea of what his 90 day journey has been like with uh, the Contractor AI. And more importantly, what he's, what he's achieved. So super proud of this guy, he's really done the hard work and leaned into things. Um, I, you know, from my perspective, an ideal student. Um, so Nick, just to kind of get going here, tell me a little bit of why you, um, what you were struggling with and why you came um, to Contractor AI. Well, uh, like a lot of people at the beginning of the year and uh, like last year, it was starting to slow down in the construction industry. So I saw that we needed to do something because we still had a lot of job lined up until the beginning of the year. But I was getting calls from guys looking for work like three, four, five times a week. And I was like, this is not this is not good. And uh, we were losing a lot of jobs uh, because of pricing and like so people starting, you know, just cutting prices just to get the work going. So I figured like, yeah, I need to do something. I need to increase, you know, the our exposure and number of leads that we're getting. And so I started doing a little bit of marketing with no idea. Like I, I'm, I started contracting just kind of like that with no mm -hmm. background, no nothing. So I just like, oh, I would try something. Then eh, it's working. Try something. It doesn't work. It's not working. So I just like just learn on the go. So that's why I was doing like some random marketing things here and there. And I got no return from anything so far. So that's when you came in and you contacted me. Uh, and then I said, OK, maybe maybe we'll give it a try. It seems like uh, you could uh, help me with that. And that's how it started. Awesome. Awesome. And uh, tell me, what's the what have you learned in the 90 days that you've you've been with us? And, you know, what's the outcome been like? Well, I've learned I was doing a lot of things wrong and for years and uh, is now we we have way more leads, but almost like too, too many leads. I a lot of the visibility of my company looks way more professional. I got more systems to work as I was just you've seen my system. They're just mm -hmm. eh, not not very good or non-existent at all. And now it's uh, we're more like a real company instead of just some beer contractor. Right, right. Well, I mean, Nick, I got to say, from my perspective, one of the most impressive things that I seen from you was uh, your willingness to show up um, and willingness to put in the work, which is, um, again, I think a lot of contractors get caught in their head. Um, they think they don't need things, um, whereas you showed up with an open mind on every call. You took in the information, you put it to work. That's what I was really impressed with with you. I mean, there was no hesitation around, you know, succeeding with with what we were teaching and what we were trying to bring to the table. And I think that's sometimes the best way to get results, right? Um, you know, when you did come in, um, you know, we started with your sales to start off with. We've since built your CRM and your follow ups and everything else. But um, where I've seen the most growth is is really the the sales part of it, like learning to do discoveries. Just last week, um, one of the things again makes me proud, and you may not realize it yet, but was you know when you said no to that job um, where we talked about with the contractor, um, and you know we talked about it, and then you know sure enough, that's the you know it's the guy that you had to say no to. So I think you know leaving this um, the big growth spurt that I've seen in you that I'm most most proud of seeing is the ability to say no, right? Knowing now. You don't have to say yes to every job. You don't have to put yourself in that situation, um, which it takes years for guys to learn that. They continuously make the same mistake. Um, now you're seeing like, hey, there is still lots of opportunities. It just requires me to, you know, work a little bit differently with how I sell, right? Yeah. And again, this morning, I just uh, declined three jobs. There just you go. Back to back. It's, it's I just said we're not, we're not a good fit. It's not it's just not going to work. And and most uh, most of them were like okay thank you for your honesty and just yep. move on and that was it and then that, that's it through. right so but again most guys never get clear on who they do best business with and who they don't so i think that you were ready for that uh coming in and i think now you can see hey there's lots of opportunity more than i could ever do right so let's not let's sweat sweat about that it's just now i need to make sure that i'm dialing in and, and getting exactly the kind of customer i do best business with right 
yeah 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 absolutely like uh, learning how to do like a proper discovery call mm -hmm. and uh, having a follow-up system that like really changed that something that was not even doing last year and it was just kind of just winging everything and it worked right. for years but you know it's, you can't just keep winging everything so right now we're in a much better shape for sure excellent and nick what would you recommend to somebody that's uh you know kind of in in your position what would you what would you recommend to them uh yeah just just take the program it's like it's it's worth it especially if you were like me just like i said just winging everything and no system nothing just come just like you said with like an open mind and that's what i did i said i'll listen and since i got no background it worked i just want somebody who's like experienced who's done it let's let's try it and i tried everything and uh well i'm not ready for everything everything yet but mm -hmm. everything that we've tried so far it's uh it's changing for the best so yeah, yeah i'd say just go with an open mind and give it a try well that's uh that's it i wish everybody came in with that same open mind and willingness to try we'd all we'd all be getting bigger results but you've been an excellent student and uh, a pleasure to work with i'm looking forward to working with you more um, and thanks for your time. Yep. Yeah, thank you, Jake.